How's it going everybody? Dave with Cruiser Cult sitting here in front of the 60 series truck. We are going to be doing a little bit of cleaning and maintenance on the truck. Needs a lot of it. Um, but for today we are starting just with a really simple fix uh, slash cleaning. It is going to be cleaning out the fan, the basket shaped fan for the blower motor. Uh, it sits on top of the blower motor and uh, we'll point to that right here. So underneath the passenger side, you've got parts of the AC system. So fan blower motor, then you go into your evaporator core. Um, and then you've got all of the heater core and switching um, apparatus in order to move things through defrost or through the center vents or down to the feet. So we're not digging all the way into that stuff over there. We are just gonna be pulling the, th there's three screws holding this in. We're gonna drop that. We're gonna make sure that the basket's clear. We're gonna see if there's any obstructions or anything that's kind of uh, been sucked in or blown into the evaporator itself and try and clean that out. So just periodic maintenance, super simple. Let's get into it. All right, we're inside the truck. We are now gonna be digging into the fan blower motor. There are three small little Phillips screws that retain the motor, pushing it up into the housing. As we drop those down, there is a hose that we wanna, um, a vent hose, and then also the, the electrical cord. We wanna make sure we're not ripping those out as we drop this. So let's go ahead and see what's inside the basket here. If there's anything good. Okay, here's this basket shaped fan. I wasn't lucky, I didn't have anything cool in there. Um, sometimes you'll find leaves, sometimes, you know, you can find playing cards that slip behind the dash and all kinds of stuff. So uh, periodic maintenance, backing this whole thing out. Um, you can also reach in to the air box itself. Uh, if I head this way, this is the uh, evaporator core. So I can reach in and I can see if there's any junk inside there. Sometimes there'll be hair or leaves and little stuff. I can feel that there's some stuff in there. So I'm gonna try and get in there with like a really soft, flexible hose uh, that I can chop back that out. Up above, there's actually a ducting vent with some soft foam here. You'll wanna be kind of gentle with that on both sides of this. This is a flap uh, which on the HVAC controls, when you slide it one way or the other, it adjusts this for fresh air from the inside or from the outside, or you can um, pull it the other way and it'll close and it'll recirculate the air inside the cab. Um, so up above past that, you get into um, the cowl. There's a vent, a screened raised portion on the cowl um, that is up above that. And you should be able to feel, I don't know if you can hear the grate. It's like a wire grate that's up inside there. Um, so yeah, so a little bit of maintenance just to try and keep everything clean going into the evaporator core as that starts to get plugged up, uh, it'll back up and slow down. Um, it'll make the fan motor try to work harder, uh, to get things kind of pushed through there. So just one of those periodic maintenance points. A lot of people, um, aren't familiar with on these trucks, um, unless they're rehashing or re overhauling the entire, um, system here down here. So. Uh, yeah, so if you get anything fun and exciting inside your uh, blower motor uh, fan, post up, let us know. I want to know what you find in there. All right, thanks, guys. Have a great day.